I'm Paul Wharton, and this is the secret to raw food innovation. <laughs> so I'm in the kitchen at Elizabeth's Gone Raw with the executive chef, my friend, Jonathan Sinigan. Well, I want to get really good and into some of the work that you're doing here. And this segment is all about raw food innovation. And this is probably the most innovative raw food that I've ever seen. Show me how to make this plate. So the, the dish itself is a goat cheese uh, stuffed squash blossom. What we'll do is we'll start with, we'll little, start with a little bit of uh, red and yellow peppers. Okay. A little bit of salt. Um, some, some fresh lemon juice. Okay. Um, a little bit of cracked black pepper. Hash the first novel. Nice. So what we'll do is, is we're just gonna mix this up. Okay. And then we're gonna put it down um, and just in random places. Uh, so what we'll do next is we'll reach over for this other ingredient that we have. So we'll put the, we'll take the squash blossoms, take okay. the stuffed squash blossoms, and we'll put on squash blossoms and we're just going to dress them lightly with a little bit of extra virgin olive oil so we'll just put a little bundle right here and then what i'll do is i'm going to add just some uh some shaved some shaved carrots okay and a little shaved radish i'm going to put a couple of fava beans on the plate and then we'll finish it with a little bit of parsley oil. And if you'd like, you can just dot the plate with parsley oil. Just kind of paint just a little bit of. I didn't think you wanted to share. How's that? That's perfect. Okay. Fantastic. This looks absolutely beautiful. The secret to raw food innovation is making it similar to something that people are familiar with. It's, it's one of the things that's behind how to make raw food uh, approachable and innovative. Okay. And so that's that's really you know how I start to draw you know inspiration. Jonathan Sinigan here, leading the way in raw food innovation at Elizabeth's on Ale, also known as Elizabeth's Gone Raw. Thank you so much for showing us the light.